thing. Oh, watch out, boy. Looks like birds have been living in here for a while. up even more. Pretty neat. Echo. Well, from what I got from it, this was a uh, an AT and T microwave tower for sending microwave signals for something. Apparently, it was closed down early '90s. something. <clears throat> Just stairs after stairs after stairs. Not much to it. There's a room up here. And a window. Yeah, we're up there pretty good. Looks like the control room kind of thing. like they took most of the stuff out. Replacement fuses, little bus fuses. Pretty cool though. Okay, going up. Okay. Further up we go, the more dead birds you see.
It's like manuals and stuff. Schematics. What's that? Yep, there's a room. There's a room up here. Yes, okay. another view of how high up we are. We're up there pretty good. Yeah, it probably just closed down because it was uh, everything so outdated. It's all schematics and stuff. Just gonna have to check that out. No oh, man. Get windy up here. Approximately, I think about 250, 300 feet up off the ground. Really, really windy. That was kind of cool, nice view, but wicked, wicked windy. I just went out on the roof. Oh, yeah, that in there. Yeah, and it's really super windy up there. Yeah, there's uh, all sorts of stuff. <laughs> Use your manuals, troubleshooting. Okay, ready for the trek down? <laughs> That's the easy part. <laughs> Alright. Well, I'll pause this so you don't see it's falling down the stairs. <laughs> well, that was pretty cool. But windy as a mofo. 